الرحمن الرحيم Assalamu alaikum and greetings, Salishan Mo here and uh, I'm just gonna have fun with my Finwing Traveler V2 I'm still tweaking this bird um, to be, you know, to fly really well the way I want it so it's part of that tweaking as well and at the same time I'll be able to test the Sky RC HD FP video goggles with the stock antennas no fancy antennas on that, complete stock antennas let's see how it goes <laughs> Now we are talking. Now my video is not breaking. Nice and good. Heading lock mode. Across the river. Making a turn. Coming back. Video is a bit glitchy glitchy, but uh, it's doing its job. And our bird autopilot is, uh, I don't know. And even the small cheap Pigaula does a better job than our bird, I believe. It's really, really wobbly wobbly kind of flight here. Trying not to stall this staller and trying to stay away from the dreaded cables. Let's go visit the uh, marina. Heading lock is really terrible on this one. Putting it to heading lock again. It just goes away, I mean. Boats and everything. Alright, time to make make a turn or get higher. So I get uh, a good view. Now my video transmitter is behind the plane because it's on top of the tail so I'm having really serious glitches but still my video is alive. I can still know where I am. OSD is very very glitchy. I have no idea why. I think I gotta get rid of this uh, Artbird autopilot. My video is almost going away. I need to pick some altitude to dodge those cables. Yes, almost there. The stadium. Making a turn. I just need to make sure now to dodge those cables. And 
I'm gonna pick some more altitude. I believe I did dodge those cables. Way far from the RC airport, across the river. So let's make a turn and make an approach to landing. Alright, trying to cross the river, still have video, the footage today is even more clear because I'm using GoPro AV out directly, that's my approach. really beautiful and nice right about this house I always do it that's a tea house I believe coming in for landing cut down the throttle see -E a beautiful landing extremely smooth and beautiful landing so I flew the Finwing Traveler, Artbird Autopilot, my own favorite 4S battery setup, and a 600 milliwatt AOMA video transmitter. Camera is GoPro, SD camera is GoPro. I'm taking AV out because I love flying with GoPro AV out. No need for other cameras. And I tested the Sky RC Immersion Go SD FP video goggles with the stock antennas. They are doing simply fine. There's nothing special though about these goggles except that the image quality is really, really very clear. When it comes to the reception, they're almost the same compared to the other goggles. Sometimes my Ishin VR D2 Pro, they actually give better results on the reception and range. It's because I'm using a patch antenna on that. If I'm using a patch antenna on this one, I believe things will look differently. So that's what I'm gonna do next. I have an Aomway. 14 dpi patch antenna and that's what i'm gonna slap onto it and go for another flight stay tuned for that come on you know what to do hit that like button it's right there i know you can do it oh while you're at it also hit the subscribe button right there come on don't be shy just hit it thank you very much for all your support towards my work that i post regular and fresh content on my channel just for you hit that like button right there.